Alright, uh, uh, it's Sam back here with my life so far. And I've made another journal. This time I didn't use all Dollar Tree items, so it'll be something different. Um, so on the cover, I made this for another YouTuber, um, Jessica, at Gone to the Snow Dogs and Snow Dogs Vlogs. And as you can tell by their name, Snow Dogs, they really like huskies. So I made this journal all about huskies. And I have the little tassel here. It's uh, Technically it's a dog leash that I cut up and added ribbons and string and everything too. And then this is, um, what was this? Scrapbook paper and then my ribbon. And then this is a gift bag the lace and a couple buttons I put on there. Actually I had a different cover and I changed it because I didn't really like it. I had a black scarf that I cut up and used on the side and that didn't look right so I took that back off. So let's open this up. It is pretty thick as you can see um, on both sides. There's only two signatures but I filled it pretty good. So when you open it, there's a little pocket here with a little card, and then a doily, and it opens up to a quote that says, Live each day as if your life has just begun, by Joanne Wolfgang von Gothy. Not sure if that's pronounced right. Um, but that is a calendar picture that I glued some lace onto the side of that. On this side there's a little pocket that I glued down and the pocket is a postcard from Watkins Glen State Park. Um, the Snow Dogs vlogs and Gone to the Snow Dogs, they really like to go to parks with waterfalls so I figured I'd throw that in there. There's plenty of space to journal here. Um, most of these lighter pages are book pages. I left them open in case she did want a journal in here. On this page, um, they got a little Huskies picture with some lace and a little envelope. And I had to put this down so that the envelope would stay closed. In the envelope there is a picture of a Husky. And on the back, uh, I glued book page to it so that she could write on it. that back in there. There we go. Oh, maybe not all the way. There we go. Tuck it back in there. And next page, this was a um, scrapbook page from a Hobby Lobby scrapbook set. Another book page and a picture of a husky. And this is actually a pocket and in the, I put a little card that looks kind of like the inside of a rock because um, Jessica's husband Jamie likes to go rock hunting and Jess does too. And there's room enough to either put a uh, picture on the back or to um, journal on it. And then you got the inside is pictures of huskies. All these pictures of the huskies I got from a um, Siberian Husky care book from the dollar store actually. I did have to tape it down the middle because it started to rip apart. And then in this one there is a galaxy picture, uh, a card, and she can put a picture or journal on the back of that because they also like to go out, they live in northern Michigan so they can go out and see the Aurora Borealis and they take a lot of beautiful pictures. So that's in this pocket here. And I uh, glued another picture of a husky onto the back of that. Actually, one of their huskies almost looks like that one. Okay, this is a small part of another um, scrapbook paper, but I liked that it said New York on it because that's where I'm from. And then I made a little tag out of a picture of a uh, husky sled and put paper on it so she can journal up on the back of that too. And then I left this one blank for journaling. And that's another, the other side of the dog uh, paper. And this one I made a little pocket. This actually was the front pocket before I changed the uh, cover on it. 
And on the inside, I just have a little card, a Hallmark card. It's empty, so you can write in it or put pictures or whatever. Um, yeah, and then I left this page blank. And more book pages I left blank. That was just a little husky I fussy cut out. This is another picture from that book of sled dogs. Uh, they have four. And actually, uh, the Gonto Snow Dogs have had four, just not at the same time. Um, two of theirs have passed away. And I made a little pocket out of that and I put one of the book pages in there. It's got little cartoon guys on it. But you can fold it open and journal on that too. That's on both sides. And tuck that back in there. And that's just uh, the sunset of the other part of the calendar page. And then the doily. And this one is a little husky puppy. And then I made a flower out of... This was a post-it note from work. And then just some scrap paper and then a button I had. And this red part is actually a gift bag from the dollar store. But I really liked it. And there wasn't any glitter on it so I knew that Jess would like it. And you turn it over and I have this garbled mess I made just out of scraps uh, and glued it to a paper clip and it holds this tag in that also has the uh, book paper on the back of it and then there's another book page in that pocket right there slide that back on and then another page to journal on and doily and then uh, I thought this page was kind of cute it's just a whole bunch of frogs and sciencey stuff. It doesn't really go with the rest of the journal, but it was cute. So I threw there, and it really looks good with that doily over it too. On the outside, I just glued a paper part of a bag, I think it was, with a husky down to it, and she can journal all on these blank pages here. And this is actually a coloring page, and it says, I can and I will. So I thought that was cute. That in there. If she wants to color it, she can. If she doesn't, she doesn't have to. And then more pages for journaling. And here's a belly band of some ribbon. And a little envelope that I put in there. Um, there's actually, it's just a picture of me in here is all I put in there. Just so that I could show her that you can put pictures in the little envelope and put it in there. Because I'm not sure if she's ever journaled before or junk journaled. So that's in there. And then it's just the end of the frog page with the doily. I probably should have glued that part down so that, that could be another pocket, but I didn't. Um, blank page for journaling. And I, I actually got the stamp at um, the Habitat store. It was only a dollar, so I wanted to try it out. And it's actually, it's super cute. So I stamped it there and then I made the remaining stamps on uh, this side just to give it some more uh, color. But this is the uh, another card that I just threw some ink around the edges to make it look cuter. And after I thought about it, that actually would have looked really cute on the cover right there. But that's okay. So I put that in that pocket. And it's blank on the other side so she can journal on that. And then just more scraps to a flower. And this red one is actually a bandana that I cut up. And I figured it matched really well with the kind of red, white, and black that we had going on so I threw a button in the center of that too. And on this side uh, you see the back cover here. I forgot to put a pocket but this one is a diagram of the parts of a dog that I'm cut out and made into a pocket but I still left the uh, labels of what everything is. And then just on the inside pocket there is just a tiny little picture of a puppy chewing on a Kong. And then there's room for it to journal on the back of that too. And that's it guys. So that's that journal. I really like how it turned out. It came out really well. Like you, you can't feel it but it feels really nice. That paper on there and then this has a different texture to it. It's, it's cute. I really like it and I'm glad I made it. So I hope she likes it too. Um, so thanks guys for watching. Let me know in the comment section below if you liked it, if you think there was something I've missed that I should have put in it or something that 
didn't really look right or something that you really liked, that would be nice. Um, okay, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you later. Bye.